Skype is dying. What do you need to do? I've got some ideas, especially if you need to export contacts out of it. I'm going to show you how to do that. But if you didn't read the TechCrunch article, yes, May 5th, Microsoft is shutting down Skype, which I think is more of a finally than a oh no. But yeah, a lot of us are reliant on it. It's where a lot of the default communication happens. Why it's so prevalent in the direct response affiliate marketing space, I don't know, but it is. So we're going to keep rolling with it until May 5th, I guess. And then we're going to get off of it. Some things you should be doing are going to be updating your contact details and your Skype account already, right? And that's going to be up here um, in your account settings and your Skype profile, updating your contact details there, because as you go to export your contact details, ideally everyone has their stuff updated and we know to get in touch with everybody outside of there. Um, other things to note is that you can't export from here. I was trying to follow the instructions and I kept trying to go to my, my Microsoft account here and it wasn't working for me. I was getting really frustrated. didn't understand why you actually actually have to go to the Skype uh, browser and kind of export from there. And then once you get in there, it's really simple. A couple things. If you get stuck on authentication and getting logged into Microsoft, um, check your email for suspicious login activity. I haven't logged into Skype in ages. I kind of forgot how honestly because it's just open um so it looked they got suspicious i had to go find an email resolve that and then i could get logged in just fine so if you run into that check your email check your spam folders for that sort of thing but once you're ready to go and export your contacts simply go to skype.com and if you're logged into your Microsoft account, which I was because I had to jump through all those steps, you'll come to your main profile here. If not, you'll have to log in and maybe jump through some of those steps there and simply go to my account. And then scroll down and right over here is export contacts as a CSV. Pretty simple. Click on that. It's going to pop up into the download folder somewhere. I've done this a few times. And huzzah, we've got Skype contacts here. And then if you scroll to the right, which I won't to say people not share um, everyone's email and phone number and stuff like that. But if you do jump over there, you'll see their email address, phone number, whatever they kind of filled out in their Skype address. So that's why you want to go update yours. And I would recommend exporting contacts, you know, May 4th, May 3rd, sometimes before that May 5th date when it's going to shut down. That way you give people a chance to update their information and you can get the most up to date possibly or do it now because no one's probably going to do that anyway. But, you know, it might. So I'm really curious, where are you going to migrate to? Are you going to use Telegram? Are you going to use WhatsApp? I know those are the most too popular across my team here at ClickBank when they're working with a bunch of different clients all over the world and over where they might be. They like to use Telegram, WhatsApp, Skype, of course, until that goes away. They're in Facebook Messenger. They're in text threads. But really, it seems like Slack, Telegram, and WhatsApp are where we try to consolidate uh, conversations if it's not Skype. So I think those are going to be the main three to kind of get the most traction because that seems to be if it's B2B, email, Slack, if it's more solopreneur, Telegram, WhatsApp seems to solve a pretty good gap across all those. So trust has been helpful. Let me know where you're going to be moving and hopefully consolidating your communication channels into. I do think the frustrating part is you just have to be fairly omni-channel if you're working with a wide variety of clients, um, which is tough. And yeah, happy scaling, everybody. Cheers.